So fortunately, um, since we had the baby a couple of years ago, I've not been able to use the gym as much, I decided to uh, kind of set up a few little basic gym exercises in the garage for myself. So, pram out of the way, classic. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna go through some stuff which I would do, and I'm gonna fast forward it as well so you don't have to watch my whole routine. Um, and there's some stuff in there which is clearly specific to me through the trainer that I've used in the past, Arton, a floats thing. Um, and he's help, he helped me particularly with speed, strength, uh, agility, flexibility, and I still do a lot of the stuff and speak to him about how, what I can be doing to try and maintain levels of movement um, as I get older, slowing down. Uh, I've, through not playing as much over the last few years, I've lost the best part of, um, I was swinging a seven iron, 92 mile an hour a few years ago, down to about 86 now. So I've lost quite a bit of speed just through not playing and practicing as much. Um, a bit of a dip in training as well where I've not trained as much. So um, I wanna try and get back a little bit of that speed, but also make sure that I do it in a manner where my technique's still decent, I can still control where the ball's going. So um, some of this stuff you may have access to, some of it you may not, but whatever you can make use of, I think you know there's, there's various things that you can be doing, whether it's yoga, or exercises around the house, uh, stuff that you can be doing to aid your golf and, and keep improving it. Um, something that I would certainly buy into is the idea that you can only, you're only gonna swing as well as you can move. So the better that you can move, uh, the more stable that movement is, uh, the better you're gonna be able to hit your golf shots. So uh, I would certainly buy into the idea that you can that aspect over the next few weeks and months uh, so that by the time we're getting back into it you may see that you've improved just through you know your body being uh, in better shape or more flexible uh, so yeah, here we go